Thanks, Alan. Hey, Mark. How are you doing, mate? Thank you, driver. Carry on. This is the first locomotive in the world. Built by Trevizic over the winter of 1802. It's a living dinosaur in the nicest possible sense. And we're talking 10 years before George Stevenson's first attempt to hit the tracks. Trevithick's tram wagon, as he called it, had a cast iron boiler that could sustain 150 pounds per square inch of pressure, the same pressure that steam locomotives still run on today. It had an eight and a quarter inch diameter cylinder with a 54 inch stroke that was set into the boiler immediately above the flue. The piston rod connected to a crosshead reaching right across the engine and from here the drive was taken through gears to the two wheels on the left hand side and to a larger flywheel. The locomotive was cleverly designed to work as a static machine as well as on the move. It's not the easiest thing to drive and slight problem there's no brakes. To stop it you have to turn off the regulator to cut off the steam, keep an eye on the valve, grab the lever at just the right moment, and put it into reverse. Samuel Humphrey wrote, 